Hello, everybody. I wanted to take the time out because I tend at times to not give the attention to my Facebook groups as I should because a lot of times my YouTube takes up so much of my time. So I wanted to give shout outs to all my groups that I own. And I'm starting with this first group. Yes, it's very small. Um, we had over 5,000 people in here at one time, but uh, we weeded it out and thinned it down because we didn't want to have anybody that wasn't serious in this group. And this is the Kanika Jenkins Original Truth Seekers. This is the group that Ethic Radio uh, based his documentary on Kanika Jenkins about before we, uh, or I'm sorry, after we had thinned out the herd in this group. And now my second group here is called Kanika Jenkins Discussion. And as you can see, there's well over 47,000 people in this group. We have a lot of newbies coming in here all the time. Um, and this group does keep us busy. I say us because like I have um, a couple other people that help out. And like Debbie, she's a moderator in here. She helps uh, answer questions and whatnot. Next, I have my Justice for Kanika Jenkins group, which has uh, almost 5,000 people in it. That this, this group has a little bit more um, people that have been around a little while in the Kanika community. But again, Justice for Kanika Jenkins. Next on the list is Kanika Larissa Jenkins. And this group has uh, almost 9,000 members in it. This group has been around almost since the beginning of when the case had started. And this is a very versatile group, has a lot of mixed type of members in it. Another group that I have is called Kanika Jenkins Death Case File, where we have almost 1,500 people in here. And in this group, I I post up a lot of different things, but I started this group with posting up specific parts of the case file so that people can do their own research on it. Then I have this group, it's Kanika Jenkins, Justice is Coming. And it's one of the older groups as well. It has almost 600 people in it. Then I have this one. It's Kanika Jenkins Death Investigation Case Discussion with almost a thousand members. And then I have this one here that I share with my good friend, Jay Guido. Ain't no other way. It's J for K, where we have 539 members. And then I have this one, this Kanika Jenkins death case with uh, 553 members. I use my page, the Kanika Jenkins Original Truth Seekers for Justice profile on this one. But it's still me. And then I have another Kanika Jenkins discussion with 446 members. And I have this really, really old group, uh, Who Murdered Kanika Jenkins, with 2,000 members in it. And it's another diverse uh, group, has a large amount of diverse people with different opinions from all sides of this case. Then I have Kanika Jenkins Justice is Coming, which is another older group. Most of my groups are, are, are pretty old Um from 2017. They've been around all this time. A couple of them were a little bit newer, but this one has 568 members. Then I have this one that is not a Kanika group. It is Justice for Brandon Weaver that we had started for his family. And there's 447 members in there. 
And then in this one here, I help my friend Jojo. She's got it. Uh, let's discuss J for K. She has 273 members. And I say she because it's her. She started this group. And then I have all the groups that I'm actually just a member of. Like my friend Debbie's group, Kanika Jenkins speak on it. The unbiased group, the original unbiased group, what we know now, um, Boss Blake's Cousins and Conversations, Justice for Kanika. And we got a Marie's group here, J for K, All Things Kanika, Rosemont Corruption, Stand Up for Violence. I mean, there are so many groups that, yes, I am a member of that are Kanika groups. And I say that because, you know, it's been said that, oh, I, I'm just all over the place. Well, if you want to learn and or help, you can't do that by just sitting on your hands. So, but all the ones that I showed you prior to this, those are all my groups that I actually own. Plus the one that, um, like I said, that, that I help moderate with. So it's very rare that I hear about an opinion or a theory with the Kanika Jenkins that I haven't heard before. Because just my groups alone, well over 68,000 members. I went back and counted it right now. But anyway, I just wanted to say I appreciate you guys that are members. Um, I love all the, the questions and, and, and uh, theories and, and opinions. And one day we'll all know what exactly happened to this girl, I believe. Y'all have a good day.